catnip stuff. I can't be quite so close. It's so nice to get um, the reason that we've got our picture and our chat back up so we can see here is because Kurt finally got his new computer. His died. Uh, the monitor part died, but the laptop or the keyboard was still working. So we've got now the cam hooked up to his keyboard um, so we can at least have the picture up in the, in the chat line up here. And then the good news is we just heard today that Monday um, your uh, computer for the rescue center will be here will be here on Monday. So that's like a week or two weeks early, two weeks earlier than what we thought. So that'll be awesome. So um, really happy about that. So let me get our cutter and we'll get started. And I think Carolina Ash is on right now, and that's something we got to talk about um, with Carolina here when we're done with our boxes. How am I supposed to do this? How am I supposed to do this? And Goosty, if you're on, I'm still looking for your envelope. I'm sure hoping that, that it didn't get lost. We had, whoa, I'm sorry. Uh oh. I always think I'm so old. Oh, there we go. I always think I'm so organized until I get started. Um, we have a family from Brian, Carol and Paul, Paul from Brian, who adopted a cat, Lily, from here. Um, hand delivered six boxes here to the rescue center from um, family or friends of theirs in Atlanta. And they were visiting their daughter and Gloria C., Margaret G., and, um, and Linda M. got a few things together for them to bring back. So they drove them back all the way from Atlanta to Bryan, and then today they came from Bryan to Defiant. Um, it says there are a couple of things for dogs, and you can give those away if you can't use. Also, <laughs> Also, one box has a bottle of wine for you to sit back and relax and enjoy during the holidays. You may, um, uh, it's up to you if you want to show it. And uh, they had it marked, so I went ahead and opened it, that box. I didn't look at anything else. Took the wine out and put it in the refrigerator so I could have a glass tonight. <laughs> it's in the actual wine box of Charles Shaw. Um, is she says, we are so addicted to the webcam and enjoy watching all the kitties and especially the volunteers. You have an awesome group of volunteers. We sure do. Oh, thank you for all you do to help all those four-legged sweeties, especially the oldies. Ada Jean, Cutter, Asha, Cutie, Queen Bella. They give us so much pleasure watching them, the, the, watching them own the place. Just wish we were closer so that we could come and visit and hold pet and play with them all. We are not on chat, so we don't have a chat name. Maybe one of these days we'll get brave and start chatting. Have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you, guys. This is really, really nice. I appreciate that so very much. Um, you know, tomorrow is going to be a fun day for myself and my family um, once a year a couple of Saturdays before Christmas, we all get together and here, of course, and uh, we bake cookies and candy. And so that's tomorrow. And we always have a bottle of wine while we're working, maybe even two bottles of wine. But there's a lot. There's, there's myself and my four girls and then Kathy R., one of our volunteers who we consider to be part of our family. She also comes. So my house will be a total mess, but it'll be a happy house. And we love it. We love to get together. So these, um, I'll try to keep all the six boxes together from you, you three. Uh, this is the one that held the wine, so this is the best one. <laughs> uh, this is Fancy Feast, and it's a key, it's a whole case. Oh, this is a this is different. Oh, this is one of those gravy lovers. Fancy Feast. We, I've seen a couple of these. Yeah, these are nice. Thank you. Thank you. Those are awesome. Kurt's feeling better. He's back to helping the food back. We've got um, 
whisker lickens. Hey, and there's a coupon on here that we will also use. So there's four bags of whisker lickens. And this is something else that we can always, always use. We've got a, case, or a three pack of the Clorox wipes. <laughs> Fairy, you could turn around and show your better side. And a case, or um, a ream of purple, of uh, pink paper. I told somebody today, or yesterday, that brought paper, colored paper. I said, if I have a choice of using white paper versus colored paper, I love colors. I'll always, always use the colored paper. There you go, guys. Somebody can play in the box. So, this is another one of theirs. Oh, yeah, and I, um, for sure, one of them. So, there, I think there'll be five. One of them, they had my name on it and said I could open early, so I did. Oh, this is nice. Snack Mix Crunchy Dog Treats. Thank you. Public. Oh, these are those yummy ones. They, my doggies do like these. Um, Jazzy, Janie, and uh, Cammy. thank you very, very much. Oh, and chicken, bumblebee chicken. Actually, I'm doing breakfast again tomorrow, so that will be part of their breakfast. You know, I always spruce up their breakfasts big time, whether it's sardines or mackerel or chicken or something. We've got pink and goldenrod. Uh, paper. So we'll just keep adding that up over there. You know you're going to have to get off of that. And this is one more of those and this one and that one. So that's one, two, three, four, five. Yep, that would, that would make sense. Boy, you guys packed a, oh, wow, you guys packed a whole bunch of stuff in these. The balls, um, whenever we make up our adoption bay, we always add about four or five toys in every adoption bay to go home from, from here to give to our, our kitties going. And we always include some of the balls, so that will help with our adoption bay. Oh, yeah, we got this, too, to do. Can you hold that for me, Sari? Oh, and tennis balls for the dogs. Hey. And a safety dog. It's a reflective safety jacket. I'll see what size that is. If that doesn't do something for one of mine, I'll maybe see one of Stacy's doggies will. And for warmth, too. Huh. We'll check, we'll check that out and see what size that is. And the doggy balls. Uh, G, or Jazzy likes to uh, skin the tennis balls. She will pull and pull on them until she skins them. But she has fun doing them. Hey, there's your toy. And this is another box from there. That was sure nice of them to bring them all the way from Georgia. Oh my golly, look at this. Oh, these toys. Oh, this is awesome. Look at this. Look at that. There's mice and balls and fuzzy things and catnip satchels, purple. And, oh, oh, this is cute. This is a pen and sticky note with the Christmas, uh, like a posty note. And uh, the uh, candy cane pen. And a door here. Whoops. We'll put this up um, soon. We... We will ask, whoops, that's our surprise. Some of us here are planning a surprise for you webcamers, so we'll use that for part of it. But you, but I can't tell you anymore. What? Oh, look at this. This goes on to that. For, you could use this for your doggy pictures or kitty pictures. That's really cool. Wow, that is really, really a pretty frame set. Thank you. And it's got the doggy bones um, or the fishy bones to use as accent on that. That's really nice. Wow, you guys went all out for this. 
that's really a nice frame set. I'll put that up here so it doesn't get knocked over by the kitty. And a pet gift set. Oh, check that out. It's got a 28 by 36 fleece blanket. It's green. And a plush toy and another photo frame right here in it. Look at that. You can put a doggy picture or you could put a kitty picture in that. Thank you. That's really nice. Okay. Should we tell them it came though? Who's that? Um, does it say? Uh, per, per power? Is the cam name Per Power on it? It says right here. Yeah, I think per if Per Power on, is on from New Zealand, we did get your package, but it says to hold closer to Christmas, so we'll do that. But it arrives safely. And posty notes, Christmas po posty notes. Wow, this is a menagerie of everything in these. This is cool. I like that. And this is one of those real soft fleecy blankies in there. With a cute picture on the front. And I should have, watch out, Fairy, you don't back up. I should have done this one first. Because I think, oh no, no, it just says thanks to Jackie and all the volunteers. Oh, oh, that is so very nice. Oh, that is so nice. To volunteer Judy S. and Judy M., both of them, they're diabetic. And it's sugar-free Russell Stover candy. I will make sure that they get that. That is really, really considerate of you guys. And check this out. I might have to take that inside. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know, I really don't eat all this candy by myself. Honest to goodness, I don't. Um, Snickers, Reese's Pieces. Um, these are those extra scrumptious mint musketeers. You ever had those? Those are really good. And Snickers. Oh, there's about four volunteers that these are their favorite thing. And, and the kisses. You know, what we do with all these, and some, a lot of you already know, <laughs> it's too, um, we put it, We like when it's time to um, do the candy, we, we open up all the bags like this and we pour it out on the yellow table and then we mix it up and then put it in individual bags. And then our treat jar over here, um, we just keep filling it up. So I'll put these in a bag, and then we'll mix that up together. That's really nice. Look at that. I'm going to use this, you guys. Except the Reese's one might find its way in the house accidentally. And there's also... Uh, Purina fish. Oh, we we're out of these, so this will be nice. Purina fish. Um, there's two two uh, boxes of the whiska, perfectly um, fish. I'm gonna put one in the cabinet. That's oh, and this too. I this is also from them. I I have not looked at that, but I I almost peeked at it, but I didn't. A Christmas card. Oh, a doggy and a kitty. Oh, it's so nice I can actually see now again. And it says, wishing you a Christmas with many happy surprises. Hope you all have a very Merry Christmas from Linda, Gloria, Johnny, and Lucy. Atlanta, Georgia, we watch every day. Blessings to you all. You guys, thank you so much for everything. This is an awesome box load. And the box that you had my name on it, I hope that was okay that I went ahead and opened it. I loved it. There's um, a really cool Christmas plaque and uh, some um, Christmas, or some uh, kitty mugs. And what I thought was cool when I opened up those kitty mugs is I had plates to go with those, but I never got the mugs to go with them. So I thought that was cool. So check this out. <laughs> Can you see all that? To our special friends at FFRC with the lots of love from Lucy and Johnny. 
at that. That is really cool. It says, my name is Lucy. I am nine years old and have a wonderful life in my forever home. I was first rescued from an old dumpster aw, at the University of Alabama and lived in a dorm until my rescuer graduated and could, could no longer care for me. His mother found me a wonderful home. Johnny and I watch the FFRC cam every day. Sure hope you can use and enjoy these things. Very much will enjoy all those things. And then this is Johnny, a four and a half year old golden retriever. When I was two, I was left in a crate while I was being shipped to Taiwan. It was a wooden crate and I tried to get out and broke out a tooth and broke my jawbone. Adopt a great adopt a golden rescue saved me and that is how I found my forever home. I have a wonderful life now and I love Lucy and watching the kitty cam with her every day. I hope you like the things we are sending you. Love Johnny. Johnny, thank you for all the doggy things too. In this special season we wish you health, happiness and hope for all to have forever homes. Much love, Lucy and Johnny. At, from Atlanta, Georgia. This is really awesome. Isn't that cool? Yeah, what a story, especially on Johnny. Look at that. Pretty cool. Thank you for this. Well, um, I keep putting up all your cards, and, and uh, we keep them up there so everybody that visits can, can uh, look at those. Thank you for all the goodies. Everything anybody sends, we, we can use everything. We'll use it. I think we'll do this one first. This is from that wig. Uh, we had something last week. My notes kind of got messed up today. Oh, so I'm not sure if I had a note on this or not. Do we have a name? No, oh, we don't. We don't have a name. Does anybody know who it is from Wags? It's a case. Oh, it's a case of the chicken chicken soup for um, kitty kitty lover soul. Uh, I'm just going to take a quick look. I might let me see if I have a tag on it. From I think there was an email. Hmm? There was an email on it. Let's see, this one I have some items, but it doesn't say what the items are. So if if who, you know, if this is, uh, anybody knows who it is, if you jot it, let someone know on chat, Carolina Ash will see. And because uh, I still would like to say thank you to whoever sent this. Yeah. Yeah, if you could let us know, because we sure like to make sure we get the right people thanks for everything. That chicken lover um, sold for kitties and and uh, cats. That's that's nice cat food. The kitties really like it. This is our last box. Then we have a packet, and this is of course from Amazon. Also, <laughs> our UPS guy when he came today, that poor guy works late hours. We gave him a little bag of candy tonight. I think he appreciated it. Oh, this is what you kitties like. The appetizer. Let's see if there's a slip. Oh, there's no slip. Somebody's got to gotta know who sent this. Yeah, it's from Amazon. It's one of those fancy feast uh, white meat chicken and flaked tuna. So, oh, is there a... Andrew? Goss, Gossamer, this is from you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's awesome. I appreciate this. So this one's from Gossamer, um, Carolina Ash, and then... A-L-O-D-K? From this one? Or there's also an Andrew going. Andrew sent the previous box. 
Okay, so Andrew sent the chicken soup. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Well, Carolina will get it straightened out for us, and then we'll put it in the block. Thank you. We so much appreciate it. Okay, that is Andrew. That is Andrew. Okay. Thank you, Andrew. And thank you, Gossamer. This is this is good stuff. Oh, well, the Octavia can't get in the canned stuff, but I'm telling you, when we open up those appetizers, oh, we have to make sure it's behind that closed um, door or she will get it. I think the kitties would like to... Yeah, we'll open up the other end on that and let them scoot through there. So thank you, Gossamer and, uh, and Andrew for that. And this one is from Margaret M. from Houston, Texas. Whoops. Did you forget how to back up? Uh, this is to Hannah. I'm just going to get Hannah's bag out here. There we go. Yeah, we'll just keep Hannah's. Hannah also got today another card that someone dropped off and this cute, cute little white kitty with a super long tail on it. And then... This one is for Hannah, so we'll stick that in Hannah's bag. And this is for FFRC, and this is from Margaret M. from Houston, Texas. Isn't it awesome how things come from from all over the all over the world? It's just utterly amazing. And I think we have some new people on tonight, and I sure would like to tell you welcome, welcome. We we are glad to have you with us. Oh my goodness, Margaret, that is. Look at that. It's a uh, 3D. Some of these cards are just really cool. Oh, I love having you guys send me the pictures of your kitties. May the peace and joy of the season be with you throughout the year. And I think Margaret made this card herself. That is really cool. Dear Jackie, volunteers and kitties. Being able to watch the webcam and see the love you and the volunteers give the kitties is so rewarding. Thank you for sharing your days. Oh, this is Ladybug, Simon and Lily. And she sent also a donation, and this is just it's to be used where we need it and with hugs. Thank you, Margaret. So Margaret is our webcammer that is uh, Lily Bug and Simon and Lily. This one is Lily. She's black and white. Look at that nose. And this one is Simon hiding in the little crinkle bag. Thank you, Lily Bug, for sharing your, your kitties with us. And what, <clears throat> what I've been doing is when you folks send us the pictures I tape these onto your cards and then hang them up so that the volunteers also know what your kitties look like so I thought I stick them back in the envelope so I keep everything together and I'm going to put your my pocket so I don't lose it is he or who is that Danae no, uh... is that this one Pilgrim are you okay Pilgrim mm -hmm. I think he fell from in the sky. Now, this is pretty cool. We got some more envelopes for Hannah. This one's from Hannah, and there's something fun in there. I'll stick that in there. And this one, we don't have a return address. But it's to Hannah. You okay, Pilgrim? Uh, the the um, post office thing went over the name, but it looks like Dr. and Mrs. Oh, I can't quite make it out. D, but it's from Australia, from Sydney, Australia. And this is for Hannah. <laughs> she, this is just wonderful. I love the stamp, too. And this is for Miss Hannah. 
And this is from Pat and JK from Georgia. This has something to I'm so nosy. <laughs> I'm feeling all of her envelopes. I think this one might be a personal one. And this is from ABQ Cat, Albuquerque, New Mexico, for Hannah. And there's little hearts around Hannah's name. And this is from Matt and Jane D. from Palm Harbor, Florida. Matt and Jane D. from Palm Harbor, Florida. And that's for Hannah. I... I really, I almost wish I could hand deliver all this to her. Uh, this is for Hannah. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. C. H. from Auburn, Indiana. We'll stick that one in there. And this is for Hannah. Amy B. from Jackson, Michigan. We'll have to count those up and see how many we have. And I think, I think that's it. So this one is a... Uh, a Christmas card, Alf, Alfred, um, New, Ma or New York, and it says, Greetings from Alfred, New York, home of Alfred University. We are two states away and seven hours driving. You should come and see us. Not close, but not far either. Hopefully, we'll get to do a road trip to see you all. Love what you are doing and love the cam. Truly uplifts my or our, our day. Hi to all the webcammers. Big wave. And that's from, oh, this is from Sarah Grace, um, Missy P. Thank you, Sarah. Sarah Grace, thank you for your card. We'll hang that up with the rest of ours. And this one looks like it took a little beating from the post office, but they put it in a bag. But yeah, we're going to blame Gemini for that. It says, please give my sibling Gonzo Fozzie and my mommy Ernestine hugs and kisses for me. Thank you for sending me to a wonderful home. This is from Barbara. Um, Chris, Christine S. from Illinois. And goodness, boy, this did take a beating. I didn't even have to open it up. It's Oh, look at this. this there's Barbara. Remember her, our little calico girl? It says, Merry Christmas from Barbara, Felix the dog, Christy and Claude, to Jackie and Steve and all the volunteers. Boy, she is growing. Look at that. Dear Jackie. Hello, Jackie. This is Mr. and Mrs. Titan's form chat. Remember, Barbara was driven um, by Neil and Anna Marie when they adopted their baby, and then they dropped Barbara off to to um, that, this family. We would like to thank you for the gift you have given us this Christmas, who is Barbara. She is a blessing in this house and is love bunches. She is so cute and not afraid of anything at all. She loves the water, and every time we go to the bathroom, she is right behind us and goes straight for the tub and cries for the water to be turned on. She will paw at it and get a drink, then go about her business. She is growing like a spring flower. I did not say weed because we do not like weed. Oh my goodness, she's six and a half pounds and still looks skinny. She is so long. We also found a surprise the other day and had to come ask the chatters if it was normal. I went to the bathroom and when I stepped on the rug, I got a stab on the bottom of my foot. And when I looked, I found what looked like a tube. Well, we knew it was not Felix's. It was too small. We figured it was Barbara's, but she did not seem to be in pain at all. So we asked the chatters if we should go to the vet, and they said it was a normal thing. So we have a baby tooth and a keepsake box now. That's pretty cool. You know, it's not often that you find a baby tooth from the kitties because they usually swallow them. We would like to say thank you for everything you do for the kitties there. They are in the best care anyone could give, being with you and all, all the volunteers. We are so thankful that you take the time to not only care for the cats, but also your viewers. Uh, you do everything possible to make sure we are happy, even though you are extremely busy. I would say you inconvenience yourself more than most would to interact with us, and we want you to know we appreciate you and everyone there. Thank you. That's very nice. 
happy holiday and a happy new year to you and your family and all the volunteers and their families as well. Merry Christmas from Barbara, Felix the dog, Christy, and Claude. Thank you. I love this. This is very nice. I can't believe how big Barbara's gotten. She, she's really big. Did you get a good pic? Look at that. And wow. she's, she's so beautiful. Well, thank you. I'm going to just slip this back in here, and then when I get done, then I put all the, all the cards back up. And this one is from um, Norman and Jean, and Jean is a, she's a volunteer um, from here in Defiance, and they, she comes um, and just visits, and she'll sit for a long time and just pet and play with the kitties. She's wonderful. Here's her card. And it says, Merry Christmas, Jean and Norm and Wendy, their daughter. Thank you, Jean. She, I really like it when Jean comes. She just comes and she sits and she holds. And by the time she's done, I think she's petted, pet everybody. Um, Barb, or Barry, Barry and Lori P. Barry and Lori P. From um, Dyersville, Iowa. What are you doing, Patty? Uh, what you doing, buddy boy? Oh, Merry... Hey, now don't mess things up. I have to keep those organized. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. This is the Pantons. Um, Barry, Lori, Walter, and Petey. Oh, and this is for Hannah. Oh, that's awesome. I'll stick that in Hannah's bag. Check out the black and white kitties. Boy, they are handsome. Patty. Aren't they handsome? Yeah, um, then I'll save your picture for my, <laughs> for my picture boards that I have over there of, um, the web cameras. And remember, if anybody wants to send in your picture, I'd love to add some more to it. Okay, you dude. This is from Adele, Georgia. And it doesn't say FFRP, so I'll take a quick look here and see. Whoops, off on. I didn't mean to mess up the address. Oh, no. Yep, this is for, this is for the kitties. Uh, Christmas, hearts reach out and memories come alive in the warmth of love. And... Uh, May your home be filled with happiness, your hearts with love, your days with joy. At Christmas and always, Merry Christmas. From Chatters, Pam and Paula. Pam and Paula, and they're from Adele, Georgia. And look at this. They also included a card for Hannah. Oh, I just, I think that's awesome. Pam and Paula, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Beautiful card. Stacy will like looking at this one because it's got uh, glitter on it, too. And we have one more. Come on, Patty. And this one's from Canada. I am the world's worst pronouncer on some words. Saskatoon, Canada. And let's just open it up and we'll see what we got. Oh, it's a, this is a donation, um, Miss I-F-F-A-T, I-F-F-A-T, I love that name, learned about you on the Love You website. Uh, my donation is small, but I hope it helps, and your donation is wonderful. You know, there's, there's nothing like a small donation. Everything helps us. I tell people all the time, anything that is donated to us, even if it's a sponge, it is a sponge that we didn't have already. You know, so everything is always, always appreciated by us here. Thank you. And I think it's, is that pronounced if it? Um, I like that name, I-F-F-A-T. We'll have to name a kitty that sometime. Hey there, little one. Um, by golly, I think we got it. Uh, so... I don't think I have a whole lot of updates today. Oh, I wanted to tell you about Kellen. I had my paper. <laughs> you notice I said had my paper because I don't see it over here. Um, Kellen, my granddaughter, had her surgery today. 
and uh, she did really well. She's home, and uh, they did a uh, they they did surgery on her sinuses. Sometimes with these 22Q children, they uh, things are not always formed as what they should. So Kellen had to have her sinuses. Uh, they cleaned them, but they also enlarged them, and also took out quite a few polyps. So it, this was really a, gr a good thing for Kellen because with, in doing this, it will open everything up and maybe let more air in and help her uh, with her speech too. But also it will maybe help prevent some of all the, these infections that she's had so often and also with her ear problems that she has. So she did really well. She did so good. And this is the last surgery that we know of. We don't have... We don't have any, as far as we know right now, there's nothing that's really planned uh, in way of surgery for her right now. So I'm very, very happy about that. Um, I had my paper here, and I lost it. Uh, yeah. I don't see it. I'm trying to remember what questions you guys asked. Do you want to... We got our chat box up, so if anybody remembers what any of the questions were, pop them back on there. One of them was Carolina Ash uh, got a job. So congratulations, Carolina. Um, but that means on the nights that Carolina won't be on, maybe somebody could fill in for her. And what we can do is um, maybe just on those nights that she's not, I usually try to remember to ask if Carolina's on, and if she's not on, uh, then maybe somebody will offer to do that. We that wasn't nice. Um, we've had a couple people that's filled in for her a couple times, so I don't think it'll be a problem. This this is pumpkin. This is one of the P kids. Yeah, and it's, but it's P U N. K-I-N, because we had a pumpkin before. Uh, did I miss? I know I missed a couple of the questions. I'm supposed to show the three babies, the three orangies, and I'll do that. Where is Kitty Hana? Uh, let me see if I can find. What is the name you are holding? This one is pumpkin. This is our wonderful little rag doll. Um, this is Sari. And in case you missed it this morning, or, or on the blog, Sari's gained three ounces, and we've been washing her eyes and her ears every single day. Her ears look almost normal. When they came in, it was like Crest City, Crest City in there, and uh, they look really good. In her eyes, she came in with a little bit of an eye infection, and uh, that is much, much better already, too. And she's just doing so well. Her confidence level is so good. She is spectacular looking. Well, let me look for um, our little our little Hannah. How is Emma's skin? Well, she ended up having to have. There's there she is. What? What? Here's our little Hannah. Kurt took a really good picture of her. Gosh, there's so many cards, I don't see it in there. But he took a really good picture of Hannah. And it's on his Flickr site. It's an awesome picture. And we're going to send that with Hannah's things also. So, was you crying? Was you crying? Um, what do you use for ear cleaning when there's no need for mic control? <clears throat> we just use it. Um, there's solutions that are a drying agent and we just use that. You can use them for dogs and cats. There's all kinds of names that's on there. <laughs> um, oh, let me show you the, the golden kitty. Oops. Whoops. We'll put you over there. We'll put you over there. Sure. <laughs> Thank you. 
Here's Holly, Jolly, and Rolly. And this one is Holly. This is the girl, Rolly, and Holly, Rolly, and Dolly. <laughs> I don't know. I have to, I have to look now. I'm all mixed up. <laughs> but they're doing great. These guys crack me up, though. You know, DeWitt sent that um, hammock, and uh, they, they've hardly left it. They've been on there. They sleep 100% of the time in the hammock, and uh, they just don't get off of it unless they have to come down to go potty or to eat, and then right back they go up in the hammock, all three of them side by side. Holly, Jolly, and Dolly. No, it's Holly, Jolly, and Raleigh. There we go. Thanks, Mama, for putting that up there. Yeah, it's Holly, Jolly, and Raleigh. R-O-L-L-Y. There we go. Yeah, what's your question there, Mama? Raleigh. Yeah, that would be like the same spelling. Oops. Lolly, Lolly, Lolly. Here, I'm going to put it away real quick. I just forgot. <laughs> Is that, whoops, well, I missed the question. Uh, let me, yeah, yeah, Mama, you can still send the Christmas card for Hannah. Yeah, we're still okay. I'm going to send I'm going to send everything out to Hannah on Monday. Oh, gosh. Is that? Wait a minute. Boy, this month's going way too fast, isn't it? Is it? Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. Just, yeah, go ahead and get them out because, um, it, gosh, this month is going so fast. Which one is which? Okay, well, the girl, of course, is Holly. Holly. And then the boys are are the other two. <laughs> there is uh, one of them has a um, short tail, and uh, I haven't decided which one is which on that. But I shouldn't say a short tail. I clipped the very tip of it. You know how sometimes we have to give them a flat tipped tail to be able to tell the difference of identical ones. Well, that's what we did on them. So. We'll have to uh, decide which one that one's going to be. Now, let me check here, Cheryl. Today is, yeah, yeah no, we're, we're not going to send the cards out until the 19th. Okay. So, so you guys have another whole week, week and a half yet. Wiggles is still here and does not have a name um, spoken for him yet. Oh, no, Bets, I haven't still seen that purple card yet. Monday the 19th is the day that we'll send them out. So you've got another whole week yet. Nope, oh, this is Cyrilla. Had to check and make sure it wasn't Derby. Yep, you're right, Wild. Monday, Monday the 19th. Um... No, uh, Hannah's been fed quite a few times separately today. We've got a pin over there, pin three, and uh, or two, and we've been putting her in there off and on all day for her to eat. And she's got a little tummy on her. Yeah, well, I'll get Putter. That was one of them. I'll get Putter and show you. <laughs> no, I am not a groomer. But I did shave my doggy down today. There you go. That's right. Think. That's right, PJ. <laughs> oh. um, uh, I'm not sure, Queen. If they've committed to a for sure time or not, I, I don't believe that they have for um, Chaplin. Okay, cat toys, that's great. That's great. Oh, yeah, Emmeline Skin. 
um, you know, she's got that skin allergy, and we do have to, it, it's actually an immune system issue with her, and every once in a while, she has to have that steroid shot. Don't like to do that too often, but it's just a fact. It's, it's something we have to do with her. We've tried all the other options, and they do not work with her, so we have to uh, do that. I use it very sparingly. Um, and uh, but it gives her a long-term relief and she does really good on them so we just keep track of it and we never abuse how, abuse how much we give her I know I'm way behind Patty's face isn't he beautiful that's Patty P Oh, I mean Patty Kate. Yeah, Emmeline's awesome. He is Patty, that's right. You know what? Speaking of Emmeline, I actually think she's in my house right now. She gets she sneaks in every once in a while. Um, I'll we Miss Al, we use Q tips, but you got to be careful. You we there's a, a good a right way to hold the ear up and a wrong way. You just don't want to put those Q tips in too deep, or you can hurt the ear. Um, just be really careful. Maybe have your vet show you first how to do it to clean the ear, and then then you could do it. You just have to be careful. You don't go in very far. And then we actually use those grooming um, wipes to clean the out part of the ear, the flat part. Jackie? Yeah. We're still trying to find Cutter to show you. Um, Kurt's trying to find him, and in the meantime, he found Bella way up high on a brand, on one of the wood shelves. That I didn't even know she could get up that high. Um, I am so sorry. I'm so far behind on the on the chat. I probably missed something. <laughs> and and uh, Pilgrim's helping me way too much. Yeah, Patty, Patty Purs, or Patty Cake says he's very embarrassed. You know, I did start him on some medication, and as far as I know, I don't think he's peed since then. It's a medication that we only use twice a week, so it's every Wednesday and Sunday he gets. We found Pat, we found Putter, but he's um, he, he's in the restroom right now. <laughs> so when he gets out, we'll we'll um, we'll get him. Um, I'm gonna while we're waiting on Pat Putter, I'm going to uh, count the cards here. There's one, two, three. That's 14. really amazing 29 cars that's pretty cool I, d I really wish I could do hand deliver this to her that would be pretty cool so let me check on putter hey putter boy, oh, boy. <laughs> he's got such long hair it's hard to see it but he's got the green and red one and um, 
I was gone quite a bit today because of Kellen's surgery. So um, tomorrow we're going to put on some of those other really pretty colors that we got. Oh my goodness, Butter, you are really being a creep butt tonight. Now stop it. Stop, you're okay. Remember, we got these other ones too, and we're going to use some of these too tomorrow. I just didn't have enough time today to do all those. So, yeah, Cutter is really a, really a cranky. Aren't those cool? Hey, that'd be a cute, cute little headband, too. So, I also want to give you guys a heads up on something. Um, we've got a couple of the volunteers, and I got a little surprise for some of you guys, and we'll, I'm just going to tease you with it for a bit. Because uh, I can't tell you what it is. and um, But I think you guys will all get a kick out of it. And I'll, the day before we're going to do it, I'll let you know. It's going to be, I think, um, this coming week. I think it's, oh, see, I'm telling you more than I'm supposed to. It's Wednesday. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's for you guys. And uh, we're gonna, just going to do something fun. I mentioned it weeks ago that... We were going to do something, and um, so that's all I'm going to tell you. Yeah, I got to not talk anymore. Diane, if you come since you're a volunteer, I can let you in on it, but you have to promise not to tell anybody. Come here, Siri. I want to see you. Now, remember, Siri's the one. She doesn't always like to be held, but, boy, she'll let you pet her till you're too tired. <laughs> Yeah. Here's our Cyrilla. There's our Cyrilla girl. Yeah, she's pretty. And she's, you know, Siri has come around so much. She is out and about and she's playing and she's just, the confidence level in her is just amazing. Yeah. And this is the little boy. This is Picasso. I call him the big belly boy. Um, this boy, he, he likes to chase his tail. Stacy and I crack up laughing at him all the time. He'll he'll flip in the air, up and down, just chasing that little tail of his. This is very very cute, aren't you? And who's this one? Yeah, this is Pilgrim. Yes. Oh, they want to see you. Yeah. Aren't I cute? This is Pilgrim. He's one of the P babies. Not P E E, but P baby. And who we got here? Here's Gonzo. They're all coming over. Yeah, see, I'm Gonzo. Okay. Isn't, isn't that face handsome? Yes, uh, Tommy. Actually, um, our next surgery date, as you guys know, is the 17th. Um, we're going to have surgery starting in the morning on the 17th. That's a Saturday. And it's going to be one of our other vets, Dr. Um, Dr. Darcy. And uh, we're going to have Darcy look at add a uh, patty cake and then also do some of the physicals like on um, Siri and some a couple of these other adults that have come in that doesn't have to have a physical for surgery because they're already done so we'll get a couple surgeries in there and we're going to do another look on that um, KW's shoulder or, arm, or neck there So, here's Asha. Asha's collar shows really good on her. I had somebody mention today how cute their collars are. Hmm, yes. Mm, now look at them. Show them how pretty. No, come on. No, show them how pretty you are. 
Can you look at the cam? There you go. See, aren't I beautiful? Aren't I beautiful? Mm hmm Now, who could not love this girl? Aw. She does so well with her leg. Remember how light colored she was when she first came? Sure doesn't look like that now. Yeah, you love us, don't you? You happy girl? Mm -hmm. Look, yeah, I just put chapstick on. <laughs> All right, let's put you down. All right, I saw. You guys know who this is? Huh. I'll test you guys. Yeah, a nani. Isn't he a hunk? We're having a little bit of trouble with Anani. He wants to go outside. Remember, he was found outside as a full adult, so it's a little bit harder sometimes on him. Yeah, he's he is a he is a gorgeous guy, and he's so laid back. He just you're just a little love muffin, aren't you? He's the one who falls asleep on his back with his paw, paws up in the air. Yeah, that's what I tell him. He's had the big uh, horn thing go on him a couple times. Yeah, hunk a hunk of burning love, aren't you, dude? Oh, here's my girl. Here's my girl. Zelda Belda girl. See, I'm Zelda. Zelda's the one for anybody new. Zelda's the one that was caught between a store wall and a cement. Um, wall, I guess. It was very narrow. She got stuck in between it. She was so skinny. Such a skinny, skinny thing. And she, in trying to get out from in between there, she wore two big holes in her hips. But, uh, sure didn't hurt her any now. Uh, she's beautiful. Yeah, she's growing so much. She was a, a skinny, skinny thing. I love her. She's just a dear. Okay, down you go. Uh-oh. Here's one. Cutie's got her collar on. Mm-hmm. Say hi, everybody. Oh, you're so pretty, aren't you? This is Greg's cat. Oh, you're so sweet, aren't you? What you talking about, Pilgrim? Huh? Oh, here's Miss Miss Purbox. This is Donna. <laughs> oh look, she likes her necky rubbed. <laughs> Isn't she a dear? Her and uh, Cessna and uh, Weasley. Oh my goodness. They are just crazy. Crazy kitties. She's just purring and purring. Okay, why don't you sleep there with some friends? She's in there. There's Emmeline, but she's sleeping. What do you want, Pilgrim? Okay, we'll see how well you guys know your torties. Whoops, you gotta look at them so they can see your face. Let's see if they know. Mm -mm. Yeah, D.L. Menzer has it. Yep. And Sprinkle, it's Peach. Yep, Wendy. Peach has the line down her face. Oh, <laughs> what do you want? Isn't she a beauty, Torty? Yep, it's Peach. Just as soft as soft can be. Okay, check that one out. Uh 
Uh-huh. Yep, it's Preakness. Yep. Remember she came in with Derby? Boy, she's just purring her little head off, too. Yeah, you guys notice the belly band. Yeah. She's got like a gold belly band. On her. I always tell Peach has the stripe here and Preakness has that gold dot above her left eye. Yeah. They're not related, though. <laughs> Your kitties are funny. Here's Raza. This is Tilo's mama. And oh, shake your head. Isn't she pretty? She's such a nice, nice adult. This, this kitty would do so well in a home. You know, like if somebody just wants to sit and watch TV or work on the computer and just have a cat friend, Raza would be awesome for that. Raza's, gosh, what is she? She's probably about a year and a half without looking at her paperwork. She's about there. Yes, <laughs> you are right. Raza likes routine. <laughs> what you want? What are you talking? Okay, just a couple more, then I gotta get I gotta get in. This one's Adora. Say hi everybody. Isn't she a beauty? She's she's gonna find a really wonderful home. She's just so sweet. She's so friendly. Yeah, this is Paul's favorite. Isn't it funny we all have our favorites? And then when they get adopted, then we pick another favorite. She's really lovely. Such shiny fur. Silky. And another purr box. Oh, I think I have Asha here. Did you can go to sleep. Oh, now Picasso. Come on. Be nice. Okay, here's the last one. We'll see if you guys know this one. <laughs> it's Wiggles. Someday I'm just going to, some night, when we do, maybe when we don't have boxes, I'll just keep holding up one cat after the other and seeing how good you guys are. <laughs> wiggle buns. Did you hear what they called you? Uh, she's a Wiggle buns. I said, yep. I got wiggly buns. Oops, I see one more. Come here. Come here, buddy. Oh, what? Here's little awesome possum. Show them how pretty your face is. Yeah, here. There you go. It says, no, I just want to look over here. What you got? I think you got a little glitter in your eye. Aw. Oh. Yeah. He's a good boy. He's gonna he's one that will be neutered on the seventeenth. Yeah, you got a busy day that day, huh? Say so surgery, what does that mean? You're gonna lose something, dude. Says, so, Oh, how embarrassing. There you go. Down you go. Down you go. Here's the last one. Yep. <laughs> He's going to be tic tac -less. And this one. You guys know who this one is? Let's see if they know. Who said it? Giggle Flower, you're right. It's um, Cinnabon. This is one. <laughs> Both Cinnabon and McAllen drive me crazy at breakfast. They're up on the counter. I put them down. Back up on the counter. I put them down. We do this probably nine, ten times at breakfast. You just can't help it, can ya? Yeah, isn't he beautiful? He's really pretty. Aren't ya? Says you're getting a bigger belly. Yeah, you're getting a big belly. Okay, yeah, I said if we... 
If somebody comes in and brings us a purple cat, we'll take a purple. We don't have a purple. So I'm going to clean up and get things ready so I can go in. Thanks, everybody. You're very welcome. Oh, magenta. Um, oh, boy, um, well, I'm cleaning up. If I find magenta, um, I will... I will show her to you, okay? Yeah, you guys are awesome. Thank you so very much for being a part of what we do here. This is not just my rescue center. This is all of our rescue center. Huh, awesome. See, we share. Yeah, we share. All right. Let's get things put away. Just saw that about uh, some of you. Yeah, Jack Cat. Some of you were worried about Bella's legs. Um, are you talking about, uh, like the way she holds it? Is that what you're, is that what you're talking about, Jack Cat? The way that she might hold her leg a little bit differently? Yeah, you know, um, higher now, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I've, we've noticed that, a few of us have noticed that, um, since, since, uh, <laughs> yeah, she's okay, feline. I know you love her. Um, since she's had this repair on her stump, she has, you is using that leg a little bit better. But, you know, she has always used her leg, uh, some, somewhat. I mean, uh, obviously her her best way to get around is by scooting but she can she can put some weight on that leg and I don't know if it I really don't think it has anything to do with the surgery I think she's just figured out maybe that she can push off on it a little bit better but it's not a bad thing it's a it's a good thing and uh, I really looked her uh, stump over today and uh, gosh it looks really good it looks really really good the, her, oh no I was just saying you know whenever people call and say they have a kitty then it's yellow or something it's like oh my goodness we have how many of those or how many gold ones or black and white ones and I always tease that gosh if somebody calls up and says oh they have a purple cat yeah we'll take a purple cat just because it's different <laughs> it's just kind of a joke around here that we do or, or polka dotted ones I always tell them yeah, I think it is a good sign on Bella. But it's wonderful that that um, site looks so good. And I'm so glad to have the chat back up here. Um, we're going to use Kurt's uh, laptop until um, the one that you folks all made possible for us to get. It'll be in next week. Yeah, yeah. The floor is peeling up. Med, yep, Farrah got her meds. Thanks, thanks for checking. Every once in a while, I might forget. 